You know what I'd like to do before we leave? What? I'd like to take your picture. Roseman Bridge? Mm. Maybe just before the sun's coming up. You know, I'd love that. Tell me why you're not coming with me. Because no matter how I keep turning it around in my mind, it just doesn't seem like the right thing. For who? For anyone. They'll never be able to live through the talk. Richard never will. He doesn't deserve that. He hasn't hurt anyone in his life. He can move. I mean, people move. <laughs> his family has lived here for almost 100 years. He doesn't know how to live anywhere else. The kids are grown. They don't need you anymore. You told me that. And they hardly talk to you. Okay, so they don't say much. But Carolyn's 16 and she's just about to find out about all this for herself. She's going to fall in love. She's gonna try and figure out a life with someone. And if I leave, what does that say to her? What about us? What about me? Robert. No matter how much distance we put between us and this house, I'm gonna take it with me and I'm gonna feel it every minute we're together. And I'm gonna blame loving you for how much it hurts. And then even these four days won't be anything more than something sordid. You're telling me that staying here alone in a marriage? Alone in a town that you hate? In a house that you don't feel a part of? You're telling me that this is the right thing to do? We're the choices we've made, Robert. To hell with you. No, Robert, please. Don't you understand that I cannot make an entire life disappear to start a new one? All I can do is try and hold on to both. Will you please help me? 